Hi, I'm Javier Solorzano, Senior Applications Engineer at Touchstone Semiconductor. Low battery detection is important in battery power systems to alert the user to replace the battery. In some cases, a secondary level of detection is important to alert the user of a critical low battery level. Is there a circuit that can achieve all of this? Sure there is. We can use the TS-12001 nanopower voltage detector device that combines a 0.58 volt reference and a comparator with the resettable comparator latch. In this block diagram, the TS-12001 has a push-pull and an open drain output. The outputs will respond based on the non-inverting input to the comparator. The input is either a voltage generated by an internal voltage divider circuit or the voltage from the set pin. If the set voltage is above 90 millivolts, the comparator will be controlled by the set pin. If it is below 90 millivolts, the comparator will be controlled by the voltage generated by the internal voltage divider. A 0.58 volt reference is available and it is connected to the inverting input and it is used as the threshold voltage for the comparator. The output driver has a separate supply voltage pin and a latch enable function through the outage detect pin, which I will be explaining shortly. The TS-12001 provides all of this while consuming less than a microamp of supply current which makes the TS-12001 an excellent low power solution in battery powered applications. In this video, we will take a look at a simple low battery detection circuit. But first, let's take a closer look at the latch enable function. Here we have a scope capture that includes a switching input to the set pin, to the LH detect pin, and the resulting output at C out PP, which is the push pull output. When LH detect is high from zero milliseconds, to 0.5 milliseconds and from 3 milliseconds to 5.5 milliseconds, the comparator is transparent and the output follows the input. However, when LH detect toggles from high to low, the output is latched to a high state from 0.5 milliseconds to 3 milliseconds and then from 5.5 milliseconds to 6 milliseconds. Now let's take a look at the circuit. As you can see, here we have a low battery detection application circuit where two TS-12001 devices are being used and are powered by a single 1.5 volt lithium AA battery. The 1.5 volt voltage is boosted to 3 volts by a boost regulator in order to power a 3 volt microcontroller, a 74H C00N quad NAND gate device, and two LEDs. A threshold voltage of 1.356 volts and 1.288 volts is set for the top device and the bottom device, respectively. When the battery drops below the threshold, the open drain output switches from a low state to a high state. This voltage is applied to the NAND gate that then generates a low state and forward the LED and also drives the inputs of the microcontroller. The yellow LED represents a low battery event while the red LED represents a critical low battery level. For the live demonstration, the 1.5 volt AA battery powering the TS-12001 devices will be replaced by a standard power supply. Here we have a picture of the complete circuit where two TS-12001 demo boards are going to be used. Now let's take a look at the circuit in the lab. Here we have the complete circuit where the yellow LED is at the bottom and the red LED is at the top. This power supply is set at 1.5 volts in place of the 1.5 volt lithium battery. The scope is currently monitoring the outputs of the NAND gate. At this time, the outputs are at a high state at approximately 3 volts as shown on the scope, where the yellow trace represents the output driving the yellow LED and the green trace represents the outputs driving the, output driving the red LED. If I now drop the voltage to approximately 1.356 volts, you can see how the yellow LED turned on and the output voltage dropped to a, a low state at approximately 0 volts. If I now drop the voltage down further to approximately 1.288 volts, You can see how the red LED turned on and now both outputs are at a low state at approximately zero volts. In essence, the TS-12001 consumes less than a microamp of supply current, can operate at a supply voltage range of 0.65 volts to 2.5 volts, it has two outputs 
along with a 0.58 volt reference and a latch enable function, and it is available in a small 10 pin 2x2 TDFM package. This makes the TS-12001 an excellent low power solution in battery powered applications. I am Javier Solorzano, Senior Applications Engineer at Touchstone Semiconductor. Thank you for watching.